by using uh, living organs that work better than cadaver organs, you're also shortening the waiting list uh, for people who are waiting uh, transplantation. Well, first thing is that there's a severe organ shortage in this country, especially for kidneys. At any one time, there's approximately 50 to 55,000 people on the kidney transplant list waiting for a kidney transplant. And donation from relatives, loved ones, friends is a very underused alternative. Uh, that's why people wait on the list so long because the, of the organ shortage for people who are donating organs uh, after they pass away. By using uh, living organs that work better than cadaver organs, you're also shortening the waiting list uh, for people who are waiting uh, transplantation. Uh, the donors, though, or the potential donors, have to be healthy. They have to be free of any type of uh, disease that may affect their overall kidney function, either currently or as they age, like high blood pressure, diabetes, things of that nature. Um, but essentially, you just have to be a healthy person uh, with no significant medical history who has an altruistic motivation for donating.